Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android Guy. Hey guys, so today I'm giving you a brief walkthrough through a Blink Feed. So what Blink Feed is, is um, HTC's attempt at kind of like a news feed uh, type of thing. Uh, a lot of people have compared it to Flipboard and um, just, it's. I mean, it's really an RSS feed, uh, but the difference is, is how this really works and how you can kind of change it. So uh, it, right here at the top, you can go through a couple of different things. You can go through highlights. Um, you can go through highlights itself. You can go through like say like if you just wanted to see in gadget news feeds, you can see just in gadget ones. Um, if you wanted to see the Verge gadgets, Facebook or apps, um, you can see all of those. Unfortunately, no apps have really also added themselves to this, but that's more of like a future thing. You can see just your Facebook updates ones, and uh, you can kind of see highlights. Um, in highlights, however, though, too, you can select which ones are there. So if you do not want certain ones to be there, you can take them out. Uh, so that's kind of cool. Um, do I like this? So <laughs> that's a good one right now. Uh, do I like this how it compares to, like, say, like Flipboard, uh, which is what I normally use? Um, I do and I don't. I, I feel that uh, I don't see it as more of a benefit compared to Flipboard, I guess. I do often just go right to Flipboard and see that uh, as an alternative to this. I rather just look at uh, more like one or two articles in bigger size than uh, look at like multiple ones in very small. Like I don't, I feel, I don't know if it makes sense, but I feel less interested because they're smaller. Um, then I think they would grab my attention if they were bigger. Uh, so you can uh, post to Facebook from here, and I believe Twitter as well, even though I don't have my Twitter signed in. You can search for anything, so if you already kind of know ahead of time, I guess, articles you're looking for. So say in the tech industry, if I wanted to type in um, HTC, right? So since I have mobile and so like that, I believe stuff should pop up. Um, so currently on the news is this is one of the... Parts I have on my feed. If I hit enter, will any more pop up? So see, yeah, it'll only really kind of do on the highlight section. You can't really like search because I'm sure there's more things on HTC than just that. But um, if you go to uh, topics and services or customize your home screen, so if you ever wanted to change it, I do not have Blink Feed as my home just because I rather just have a home. It just makes more sense to me. Um, as well as uh, topics and services, so you can go over which topics you want to select. However, there really just isn't that many right now. You have uh, Facebook, uh, Flickr, LinkedIn, Twitter, and you have uh, lots of things like news. For technology, there's very few, which is kind of disappointing for me. Uh, I think, yes, the Android guy should be there, you know, I'm just saying. Um, and categories, uh, a little bit more. Uh, as well would be nice but those are right now I mean I'm sure they're working on it and as you can see this is kind of powered by uh, mobile republic so that is one thing that big blink feed is powered by but uh, that's for the most part it um, you can auto refresh um, when using Wi-Fi or a Wi-Fi and data and um, you can pers if you hit personalize though it just takes you right to your personalization not like this personalization. Um, but yeah, so that is how uh, Blink Feed works. If you tap on one of these articles, so let's tap on this one, uh, you do get the option to look through it and uh, share it immediately, which is kind of nice. Uh, they have the built in share, and uh, you can change the font size as well. And that's pretty much it. Um, I do like how uh, it's easy to share, uh, much like uh, Flipboard is, kind of like you have your Facebook and your top, and then just for sharing for more, um, you can see all of them. So uh, overall, is Blink Feed an improvement? I think it needs more support before we can say that. And um, once it gets the support, then I think it'll be good. But other than that, uh, I don't know. I like, like I said, uh, more articles right away, and I feel this animation takes too long. I mean, I know that might sound funny, but like the Flipboard animation seems a little bit quicker. Uh, 
but I don't know. I, I actually don't mind this as much as I mind uh, the gallery. So I want to show you in contrast with the one thing that HTC would do with their gallery. I know this is a blink feed walkthrough, but uh, one thing actually is they put um, Facebook on here by person, and there's no way to filter it. So that kind of became annoying to me uh, because, yeah, like I just wish they would, you know, then stay with this, but don't like change everything in the gallery as well than if you do that kind of thing. Uh, but yeah, that was just one thing I noticed that they kind of made Bink feed and the gallery kind of the same thing, not in terms of articles, of course, but in terms of like the Facebook and the way it's laid out. Um, so yeah, that was just a walkthrough on Blink feed. Uh, what do you guys think? Do you guys think like you would really use this all the time or would you just stick to like Flipboard, Pulse or any of the other RSS feeds? Uh, let me know in the comment section down below. Tell me what you think. This has been RCKY, the Android guy.